At first glance, it appears to be just another of the many homes under construction in one of the hottest housing markets in the nation. But a closer look and listen. It is very, very important that this stiff back is down tight and touching this joist. Reveals that this Grand Prairie home site is also a classroom and an innovative case study on how a city is enhancing its mission to build a better community by investing in its future. Our city manager and our GPISD superintendent came together and they were looking for a way where we could use these trades classes in a cooperative effort with the city. What you do is you pull from you pull from this point to the center of the first one. They are the future builders of America from Grand Prairie High School. Students that are getting the opportunity to do what no one in their program has done before. Helping the Housing and Neighborhood Services Department build a home for a participant in its home ownership orientation program. And in effect, helping them provide affordable housing. We're providing for a family to realize the American dream. The American dream for everyone is to own a home. The other thing is, is under our home program, the program that the federal government funds, we have to have a match. And in having to have a match for the funds that they provide, this allows us to use the volunteer labor hours of the students to provide for that match. Whenever you get to the end, you're going to have... 24 or less 8, you're going to have about a 16 inch drop. You'll have to cut it off and start with a new one because it has to hit on centers. Providing guidance is their teacher, Scotty Elmore, a general contractor for 23 years before he decided to pay it forward four years ago and get the Career Technical Education Future Builders program at GP High off the ground. He take his time and take his skills and pass it on to us. Uh, not, not a lot of teachers or schools get the chance to come out here and build an actual house for someone in need. So for me, and I'm pretty sure for them too, it's really important for Mr. Omar to pass down his skills to us, and we appreciate all the help he gives us. These boys and girls, they take a lot of pride, not only in their high school and in the program that we're part of, but also that this home is, is part of their creation. The lessons I've learned by working on this project is hardship, responsibility, um, and like knowing that you should put yourself up front even if others don't, so you should be the leader. As you're cutting through here, ignore this guard. These teenagers are also getting invaluable knowledge and experience toward a possible career path. Skip like this one space and then put on the other one? Correct. And maybe even more important, a new sense of achievement and pride that will carry on long after their job here is done. I have no doubt that these young men and women will drive by this home for many years to come and point to their friends or to their parents or maybe even to their kids and say, hey, I built that when I was in high school. It warms my heart because I know I'm helping someone in need that really needs a house. I'm helping that person to have a future house, somewhere warm to live. They're going to grow up in that house, maybe raise a family, and I'll be proud knowing that I contributed to this. I like giving back to the community. I've been here most of my life. Uh, to be able to give back to them the way they gave to me is an accomplishment. It's not hard to see this house as more than just a house, because it's also a shining example of the continuing commitment of Grand Prairie's Housing and Neighborhood Services Department to rehabilitate and revitalize neighborhoods, to create new ways to make home ownership dreams come true, and to inspire possibilities for a new generation. In the years to come, as the city gets more comfortable with our competencies and as our students learn more of the trades, then they can take it and run with them and chase the career that they want to be in. That is our goal. We're going to get there. But right now, they're taking pride in learning and being able to someday make a living doing what they're doing. But greater than that, they provided a home for a deserving family.